Hello viewers, this is the second part of the video for the song Paramudir Chole Yanakagatan from Marsham Padanaru. If you want to view the chords cover for this song, please see part 1 video link in the description below. In this second part, we are going to see the scale, the chords and the strumming pattern. This is a fairly easy song for beginners to play because the chords are quite simple. The scale of this song is in D major. The beauty of this particular scale in this song is it is a D major scale with a flattened 7th note. So in D major there are two sharps F sharp and C sharp. The 7th note in D major scale is C sharp. So maestro has flattened the 7th note C sharp by half a note which is a C. So throughout the song if you play the tabs for the song you will always play a C note and C sharp note will never come in any part of the song. That is the beauty of this song. Now we will see the strumming pattern that I have used in part 1 video. It is down, down up, down up, down up. Slow, down, down up, down up, down up. Super slow, down, down up, down up, down up. With the actual tempo of the song. So that is the strumming pattern. Now we will see the list of chords used in the song. The first chord is D major. The next chord is C major. The next chord is G major 7th. The notes for G major 7th are G, B, D and the 7th note in G major is F sharp. So the easiest way to hold G major 7th in the chord progression is you hold D major and remove all the fingers except the middle finger. Then you strike only the first 4 strings and not the 5th and the 6th. So we see the notes for the first 4 strings they are D. G, B and F sharp. So the easiest way to hold G major 7th is this way. The next chord is E minor. The next chord is C major 7th. You hold C major and then remove the index finger. That is C major 7th. The next chord is a minor 7th. So you hold A minor and then remove the ring finger. That is A minor 7th. So these are the chords used in this song. If you want to view the complete chords for this song, please see the description below. Now we will see the chords line by line starting with the prelude. The prelude starts with D major. La 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 is C major. La la la. The second line eh, eh, ho, ho, is D major. La la la. That is G major seventh. La la la. So the first two lines. Eh, eh, ho, ho, la la la. Eh, eh, ho, ho, la la la. The next we have oh, oh, that is C, oh, oh, D, oh, oh, G major 7th, then oh, 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 the last O is D. So those two lines. So 
that is the prelude now we will see pallavi chords line by line the first line of pallavi starts with d major paramudir cholai enakkaga than two chords enakkaga is c major than is d major the next line is very similar to the first line so paramudir cholai enakkaga than padaitavan padaitan adarkaga than the next line is fully g major ஜாலம்ஜர் Lam is A minor 7th. So that line fully. Kolam adhan jalam. Yingu you continue with A minor 7th from the previous line. Ora iram we have two chords. Ora iram is C major. When that A iram is dragged the second part of the drag is D major. So that line. Yingu ora iram. So those two lines Kolam adhan jalam Yingu ora iram Goes to Pallavi Paramudir cholai Yanakkagathan Padaitavan padaitan Adarkagathan So now we will see the prelude and Pallavi with a slow tempo of the strumming pattern. that is the end of pallavi chords now we will move to charanam chords the first and second line of charanam is fully d major uratil pogindra meghangale ural kal podungal meele the next line ver konda poonjole ver konda is d major poonjole is g major neer kondu aada is fully d major so So the first three line chords repeats for the next three line as well. So The next line Paravegal Polnam Paravegal is D major Polnam is C major Parandida Vendum Parandida is D major Vendum is G major So Paravegal Polnam Parandida Vendum The next line similar to the previous line Pani Malai Mena Parandida Vendum The last two lines of Charanam is very similar to the last two lines of pallavi edo oru bodhi manam kondaadude kosu pallavi
பல்லவி Now we will see charnam calls the slow tempo of the strumming dhurati bodinda me dangale dural kal podangal bhoomile e ponda ponjolai e ponda aare e irmi kotum naregale iragal So that is the end of Charnam Chords. I hope you find this easier. Thank you for watching.